Day eight. Let's get into it. <sighs> Day eight. What can I say? You know, I feel like on the end of this, after 30 days, there is really something wonderful waiting for me. Aside from my future self, I feel like I'm going to keep on using that term, my future self. Aside from whatever the accomplishment of completing my 30-day goal of posting on YouTube, I feel like there's going to be something really beautiful waiting at the end because if I tell you <laughs> the amount of challenges that I think that, that I experience daily, it's, uh, hey, it's really like, okay, all right. I made a commitment. I'm in it to win it. And nothing can sway my perspective or or my focus on that. I'm sharing that to say, whatever it is that you're going through, whatever promise, commitment you made to yourself, weather the storm. <laughs> whether it's a light rain, whether it's a torrential downpour, weather the storm. You'll thank yourself later. I'm confident of it. You'll thank yourself later. Today was another one of those days where my wait, every waking moment it seems was full of something that it was like, ah, oh, and this, oh my goodness, and that. And um, yeah, and that's okay. That's okay. In some ways I feel like it comes with the territory. In other ways I'm like, okay, let me revision all of this. What is it, like how do I want my day to go? How do I want my day to flow? How do I want to mindfully navigate throughout my day so that I'm not so flustered? Not that I was like terribly flustered today. It was actually a pretty good day but it was just the amount of things that I had to tick off my list today. And um, I think I just wanted a little bit of a breather to come up for some fresh air. But sometimes, sometimes that's not the case. Or I won't even say that's not the case. I'll say it takes practice for that to be a constant case, moment by moment. It's almost like we have to step outside of our physical what we see in front of us and then uh, visualize what it is that we desire to experience in that moment and then the moment after and then the day after and the week and the month and the year after so yeah overall it was a good day I am happy to be posting I had <laughs> another minor technical issue and so even inside of that, I'm observing myself like, is there something subconsciously going on where I think that maybe my days are going to be filled with additional challenges aside from posting every day? That's an observation that I'm going to sit with this evening as I go into my week of reflection and, and mindfulness. And speaking of vision, I want to encourage anyone watching this video, hear these words now. It is November, okay, technically November, 2024. I'll talk more about that later because my perspective of time, I don't know, it's a little different, but we'll get around to that after we get familiar with each other. But it is November, 2024. 2025 is a month and a half away at best. I want to encourage everyone to commit some time this weekend to mapping out their 2025. Pay no mind to what's going on in front of you right now or what the world is looking like right now. Just really commit some time. Your best, if things were to go in your favor, how would you desire your life to be in 2025 and beyond? I, I've just been inspired to really share that 
<laughs> at this moment. So I'm sharing it at this moment. As we're thinking about our, our days ahead, our weeks ahead, our months, our years, how do we want that to look? Because again, gosh, okay, me and numbers. It's day eight for me, so I have 22 more days. I desire for these days to flow, for people to really be moved by these videos in some kind of way. It doesn't have to be like, oh my gosh, she's the best. But if you feel so inclined to share these with people and you just wanna like and share and subscribe, go ahead. Bottom line, i doing this in part for myself, but also because I genuinely enjoy sharing and pouring into others. And I truly, I truly pray that someone, somewhere out there <laughs> is getting something out of these videos. So there, and I also say so a lot. I'm gonna work on that in my coming videos. That's one of my self observations. Anyway. This is day eight. It is Friday and I am looking forward to resting, reflecting, observing, reassessing, revisioning, and preparing my days to come for how I desire for them to be. And with that, this is day eight. That's what I got.